it is the next day. I apologize for this, but I don't know why I'm apologizing because it is what it is. You girls having a seriously late day. It is currently 2.51. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but we had got this pack and play. And we bought it off somebody. It's really cute. I can show you uh, really quickly, but it's just pretty simple. It has a big changing pad, the little thingy, and then the little actual mat part with the little organizer on the side. I feel like I'm having a lazy day because I'm just physically exhausted from everything, from the baby shower, then we did a bunch of shopping. I think I mentioned it in another piece or whatever. We've been trying to hurry up and get a whole bunch of last minute stuff for baby before she gets here. My eyebrows are something to talk about. <laughs> I wish I had something to sit this on. Hold on. It took me so long to find a different space. I don't even remember what I was talking about. But I believe I was at my body being so achy. <laughs> we spent literally two days going to multiple targets and bye bye babies. I wonder if that's everywhere. I'm not really sure yet. To kind of stock up and do everything we need to do. The only thing that we're missing at this point is the pack and play mattress a dresser drawer for her room and we want to get a day bed the plan of today is to wash everything that we got from the baby shower and put stuff on the hanger as well as be able to fold stuff up and put it into her room i bought four cubes so i think i'm just gonna go ahead and start putting some of the clothes in there as well and use that as a drawer until we can get an actual dresser crazy to me now that i think about it because it's been so many years that we have actually bought a dresser drawer how expensive dresser drawers are like why are dresser drawers like the same price as a bedroom set like that's just crazy but whatever so today outside of washing her clothes i'm going to take the tape painter's tape off the edging and clean up all the mess that I pretty much made. Uh, I looked at it last night, it looked pretty good or it looked good enough. I don't think it's worth buying more paint. Also, I may end up starting to pack some of David's stuff for the hospital bag. Now that it's time, I don't know if I just wanna use a suitcase because I don't know if it's worth 40, 50 dollars or whatever to go buy a uh, hospital bag i know over the couple of last couple of weeks i've been so over pregnancy and i just like oh i want her to come i want her to come and now it's like like i'm not ready but i'm ready now i'm not so anxious for her to be here but because i know that i have things that i still need to do before she does get here i guess let's just go ahead and get in this room <laughs> All right, so before I get to start taking the edges off, I just wanna show you guys what it looks like. And I am overall pretty proud with it. Like I said, it had some patchy spots, but they're not really that noticeable. And I know y'all guys see that I put the glitter on there. Y'all probably like, where's the glitter? Doesn't really show that good on camera, but let me see if I can put a flashlight to it and now you can see it. Can you guys see? It's very subtle. It's not like dramatic. Let me see if I do it like that. Maybe like that. Which I like that it's subtle. But to be honest, I probably would have put one more pack of glitter in it. But in person, you can see that it's something on the wall. It's just not smack dab in your face. So overall, 
I think the job went pretty well. There's like minor patchy spots, but like I said, it's not really noticeable. Like you can probably see a little bit right there. Right there. Now I don't think it's worth that. Shigali, honestly, it looked more patchy on camera than it does in person right there. So let's get to taking this stuff off and then I'm gonna also put the little white pluggy things back on. All right, so it's been quite a few hours since I completed the room for the most part, as far as the painting and getting everything out the way. Still doing a lot of organizing, but hopefully one day we can do a nursery tour to completely show you the outcome. But I wanted to show you guys how everything turned out. As you see, I did move the crib over here. So I just gotta clean that stuff out. And right now I'm just organizing her clothes and sizes and stuff like that. So I can just kind of put it back up here and get this thing situated. But David just came home and I told him to hold off for a second before seeing the room. And I want to see how he feels about the job because as you know from yesterday, I completely did this room by myself and I am super proud of myself. So let me see what he completely thinks now that everything kind of looks like almost a nursery. <laughs> All right, so babe, you can go ahead and come in. I told him to turn around. <laughs> so I completely finished the room and I know that there's little spots and stuff that is probably not the best, but uh, what do you think? It looks really good in here. I, I don't know why, but it felt a little bigger. It felt bigger now? Yeah. You know what? It kind of does feel a little bit bigger. Yeah. Um, and then, like, when I looked at that wall right there, mm -hmm. I see all the sparkles. Yeah, I was telling them earlier that um, I can't really see it on camera that well, so I am sweating. But when you do come in here, you do see the sparkle on this wall mm -hmm. or whatnot. So, that's pretty good. It's but... cool. It's cool in here. I like this color. I didn't think it would be such a difference, but mm -hmm. subtle, but be different at the same time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think this almost looks like the best room in the house already. Yeah, it's the funnest room in the house. <laughs> but, but I think once this room is filled up, we're probably gonna be hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was, I'm, I'm already plotting on our TV. TV? Yeah. Yeah. And we don't use it. Let's get it, put the day bed right there. Yeah, guys, we got the day bed, so it's going to go over here. And the only thing we are missing is the dresser. And that's really the last thing to go in this room outside of minor decorations. So I think also when you start putting stuff in here too, yeah, it's going to pop more against this color. Oh, it'll really pop. Yeah, because before, everything looked kind of dead a little bit. Mm -hmm. But I think... But you did a good job finishing up. You proud of me? Yeah. I worked hard and I, I broke my back. I'm sorry. I can get a massage. Mm. 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 It's giving that mystical feel that that you wanted. Is it? Yeah. Yes. Cause this looks like, you know, some type of Disney type of, you know, magic on this wall. See? Just, whoosh, 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 whoosh. That's what I'm hoping. <laughs> I even think we probably could even did one more. One more what? Glitter. Or would that have been too much? I think it's good, like, I think if you brought the light down more, you'd be able to see it more around, but you, you see it mostly up here because the light's the light, up here. Yeah. yeah. I think even if we changed it to a white light, maybe it would be even better. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so this room is done with painting. So y'all want- Feels like a big accomplishment. <sighs> Don't it. <laughs> Child, and I just got finished washing all her clothes. I am folding that now. And I'm about to organize that. And then I just got to clean up this little messy pile thing. But 
overall it's it's time to start filling up this room and i'm excited about that so you guys will see the completed look whenever we complete it <laughs> so yeah this is all this is the day i think i'm gonna end up this vlog and create a new one and yeah we love you guys and thank you guys for watching and subscribe <laughs> if you haven't already subscribe if you haven't already like this video like this video and we'll see you in the next one in the next one all right bye bye